Now we turn to the new Congress, and today it was Senate Republicans picking their own leadership team for the next term. Republicans who will be in the minority now, remember, for the first time in years. And as NBC's Chip Reed tells us tonight, they reached out to an old hand who just about everybody thought was finished a while back. Banished from the Republican leadership four years ago, Mississippi Senator Trent Lott is back. I'm honored to be a part of this leadership team. In a stunning victory, Lott won his leadership race today by a single vote, making him second in command behind new Republican leader Mitch McConnell of Kentucky. For six years, Lott was the Senate Republican leader before his dramatic fall from power. It was triggered by comments he made in 2002 at a birthday party for then-Senator Strom Thurmond, who in 1948 ran for president calling for segregation of the races. When Strom Thurmond ran for president, we voted for him. We're proud of it. And if the rest of the country had followed our lead, we wouldn't have had all these problems over all these years either. After a firestorm of criticism, Lott stepped down. Now, four years later, political resurrection. Analyst James Thurber says there's still some taint from the Thurman comments, but it's outweighed by Lott's value now that his party is in the minority. He knows the rules. He knows how to build coalitions. He knows how to tie up the Senate. And they need that right now when they're competing with the Democrats. Lott has long blamed the White House for helping push him out of power. Now that he's back in power, he got a call from the president today congratulating him on his new job. Chip Reed, NBC News, the Capitol.